Hello friends! In this video, I will talk about Czech Dam's big projects that have been opened in Logar Province. Stay with me until the end of this video and know how the fame of Logar Province is attractive to you and what features make this province unique. How can you play a role in the development and improvement of irrigation infrastructure and water resources management in Logar Province? If you work in a district, what effect will you have on increasing food security and creating employment in that area? How can you benefit from the experiences and knowledge gained from irrigation projects in Logar Province in other regions to solve water and agricultural problems? As you know, Logar Province has gained fame as one of the important regions of the country. This province, with its fertile lands and dynamic population, has always needed to develop and improve irrigation infrastructure. But since the water resources in this area were limited, the central government together with the local people decided to implement extensive irrigation projects and with joint efforts, these measures have been successful. Check dam projects, which have recently been put into operation, are the result of understanding and coordination between the central government and the people of Logar province. With a total value of nearly 17 million Afghani, these projects have given great importance to irrigation infrastructure and water management. Due to the implementation of these projects, work has been provided for 500 people and 36,000 cubic meters of water has been made available as a reserve. By carefully organizing these projects, the Ministry of Water and Energy has played an important role in water management, controlling monsoon floods and strengthening underground water resources. These measures have helped to exploit water for agriculture and have been effective in dealing with floods and infrastructure problems. The financing of these projects through the Islamic Emirate of Afghanistan shows the government's commitment to the development of water resources and its optimal management. These efforts help to increase agricultural production and also help to create employment for 500 people of Logar province and increase the income of the population. The projects have been implemented in Barki, Barak, Kushi, Karwar, and Chark districts of Logar province. In Barki Barak district, with a population of about 101,000 people, Czech Dam has been established to improve irrigation infrastructure and water management. This district, with its old historical history and named after the historical tribe of Ormor, was the starting point of the projects. And recently, with the completion of the project, it has become a dynamic center. Kushi District is also located in the east of Logar Province with a diverse population of Pashtuns, Tajiks, and Hazaras. This district, with its beautiful scenery and abundant nature, has become a center for irrigation projects. Czech Dam, which was implemented here, plays an important role in creating employment and increasing the capacity of the population. Karwar District, with a population of about 40,000 people, is also one of the areas where irrigation projects have been implemented. This district, 90 kilometers from Kabul, shows the development of water and energy in it. Also, Chark Logar District, which is located in the southern part of Logar Province, has also recently put into operation a check dam to improve irrigation conditions. Irrigation projects in Logar Province have contributed to economic development and increased income of the population and are an outstanding example of coordination and positive interaction between the central government and the local people to achieve the goals of sustainable development and increase the quality of life of the local population. These efforts have helped to improve the living conditions of farmers and have helped to deal with water and infrastructure challenges. Irrigation projects in Logar province have brought positive effects as a successful model in sustainable development. These projects, beyond water management and agriculture, also control monsoon floods, which can prevent infrastructural weaknesses and human and financial losses. Logar province, with its ethnic and linguistic diversity, has advanced to achieve harmony between minorities by implementing irrigation projects and has provided the most basic example of interaction between the central government and local communities. This effective interaction is a living example of the government's commitment to achieving the goals of sustainable development and increasing the quality of life of the people. It represents a significant success. Irrigation projects in Logar province, in addition to economic effects, have also helped to improve people's living conditions. These efforts to increase agricultural production 
resist water shortages, and improve the infrastructure of different regions have formed the most fundamental factors of positive economic and social developments in Logar Province. Also, by providing water for agricultural lands and creating irrigation infrastructure, these projects have helped to create jobs in different districts and improve the ability level of the population of the region. These measures in the path of sustainable development have also helped to prevent the destruction of the environment and preserve natural resources. Check dams built in Logar Province depict an example of development in the field of water resources and agriculture. These projects, with a combination of the government's efforts, active participation of the people, and reflecting the commitment to the development and improvement of the population's life, are considered as an outstanding example of positive interaction in order to achieve the goals of sustainable development. These projects reflect the fact that coordination and cooperation between the central government and local communities is the key to the health and sustainable growth of a society. When the first drops of water fall from the faucets to the ground, this important moment indicates the improvement of the irrigation infrastructure and brings hope and change to the people of Logar Province. This water, by increasing the production of agricultural products, helps prevent food shortages and increase food security in the region. Irrigation projects in Logar Province, in addition to direct effects on agriculture and economy, have also led to the improvement of people's awareness and capability. With the start of using check dams, training courses have been held, and the process of educating and informing the society has continued in the form of continuous activities. These trainings have taught people how to use water resources more efficiently and to follow management frameworks to protect these resources. Also, researches and studies conducted in the field of water management and agriculture have accelerated the increase of people's knowledge and technology. These projects remind the society that the optimal use of water resources is one of the basic priorities for sustainable development and smart management. The effects of these projects are felt throughout people's lives. From small villages to big cities of Logar Province, everyone is witnessing the brave improvements in irrigation infrastructure, employment, and improvement of living conditions. These projects are considered as positive models at the national level due to their successful implementation and balancing between economic needs and environmental protection. In this journey towards development and progress, every drop of water that falls from the taps is change and hope for the people of Logar Province. These projects have helped to increase agricultural production and income of the population. And as a successful example of interaction and cooperation, in order to achieve the goals of sustainable development, they have guided the fate of Logar Province to brighter days. Thank you for watching. <laughs>